mother could see me play. Yeah? When does she get out? Six months? Warden license. <laughs> what is this doing in my office? <gasps> There's my baby. Get well, Angel. We never go into Mr. Dugan's office unless we're invited, baby. There are things in there that could hurt you. Like what? Me. No, not this way. Mr. Dugan? Yeah? What are you doing in the locker room? The girls are in a state of disabuse. Disabuse? They are not fully clothed. Oh, well, who cares? You're the one who makes my coffee perk. <laughs> girls, hurry up. <laughs> Goodbye, Miss Cuthbert. <laughs> All right, girls. Good game today. You got a day off tomorrow. Uh, Kit, you're pitching Tuesday. Betty on Wednesday. Hey, Jimmy, yeah. hey. That couldn't have been Gabby Wallace I saw in the stands, could it? Could. Was and is. Wow, one of the all-time greats. Yeah, and I thought I saw Luke and Cade. Yep, just about all of my old teammates from the 29 Cubs are here today. Those bald, fat guys? Hey, <laughs> those bald, fat guys represent a lot of baseball history. Let's just see if in 15 years you're not a bunch of bald, fat guys, okay? <laughs> and Jimmy, those guys are even older than you. Well, in 29, they were already a veteran ball club. Most of the guys were in their 30s. How old were you in 29? Four. I was five. Oh, seven. Oh, <laughs> shut up. The point is, I was the kid on that team. Had 151 RBIs that season. Dugan, 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 Dugan. We made it to the series. I went on, had a glorious career, but for most of those fellas, well, it was the last hurrah. Well, so what are they all doing here? Oh, well, uh, they're on an outing from the old age home. <laughs> no, uh, they had a reunion and I couldn't make it, so they came down here. Spent a couple of days with the kid. Oh. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'm taking out to the Suds Bucket tonight. They've been alerted in Scotland to make more whiskey. Hey, if Jimmy's going to the Suds Bucket tonight, where are we going? Jimmy doesn't care if we go out. Miss Cuthbert, we gotta be. Yeah. Okay, now, girl. Go. Some of you have been receiving phone calls from gentlemen after 7 o'clock. Now, I will not have it. That is the hour when we all gather in the parlor for the singing of show tunes. <laughs> Miss Cuthbert, telephone. Oh. And it's a man. Ooh. <laughs> and after 7. Ooh. Never you mind. Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> May! It's 8 o'clock. She's still here. Doris. It's just this sort of impatience that caused your mother to enter the bank too soon and get arrested. <laughs> it's all taken care of. Oh! Oh, no! Girls, I uh, have to go out for a moment. I, I, I have to go and visit a sick friend. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> to call Miss Cuthbert and tell her that her nephew, Roy, the seminary student? Yeah, that he was arrested in Chicago for public indecency. <laughs> <laughs> She's not a way to bail him out now. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay, now come on, everyone get ready, let's get going. Okay, okay. okay. Ready? let's go. Why don't you sit? Why don't you come? You're going with them? Yeah. Well, look, it, I don't think you should be hanging around with men. Hurry up, let's go. Why? Well, I heard from some of the girls. May's gone all the way. <laughs> Still works. <laughs> so? 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 You've gone all the way. That's different. I'm married. I have to go all the way. <laughs> I mean, I'm supposed to. I mean, I get to. What's it like? What? I've always been too nervous to ask you. What's it like? <sighs> it's, uh... Fine. It's it's very um, it's it's refreshing. Like Coca Cola? No, it's not like that. It's it's. You really want to hear about this? Yeah. I asked Mom about it one time, and she said it was something that after I got married, I'd get used to. <laughs> Eventually. No, it's not like that. It's it's. Ready. Battle station. Can't. Why don't do a little dancing? You know. Betty. 
What, are you crazy? Well, she is single. She's not single, she's a widow. <laughs> well, she never gets to do anything. Listen, ask her. Come on. All right. Betty? Would you like to come to the Suds Bucket with us? Yeah, we're just gonna have a little fun. Yeah, but not too much fun. If we have too much fun, you tell us. We'll stop immediately. <laughs> hey, you're allowed to have fun. Betty, so are you. Well... No, look, I'm right in the middle of this book, but maybe next time, okay? Sure. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Fine. Hey, thanks. <laughs> Boy, she's cute. Yeah. So, uh, anything gonna happen? I sure hope so. <laughs> <laughs> hey, kid. We're empty. Really? Another round. Boy, elephants don't drink this much. Jimmy, your uh, ball players do a mean jitterbug. Uh, kid, why would you coach women? Come on, you know why? It's giving them some private instruction. <laughs> Just kids, you know. One of them used to be four. Right. This from a guy we used to call the carpenter, because he nailed every day. <laughs> now, the truth is I took the job because the money's not bad, and actually, some of them are pretty good. Whoa! Whoa! You are not going to say ball players. Ball players? <laughs> what? Well, Gabby, I guess 40 beers is your limit. <laughs> and now, Tommy Dorsey and his orchestra coming to you live from the Aragon Ballroom. Miss Cuthbert! Earlier this evening, I received a phone call of a most heinous nature. In response to this telephonic grotesquerie, I was on my way to Chicago to visit my nephew Roy. This angel, this paragon, that's a nose dear, not a guitar. <laughs> He was coming to see me. That phone call was a sham, a ruse, a revenir brave lui. <laughs> now, where are those girls? I got my truck parked outside. Good place for it. <laughs> you you want to come out and see it? I've seen a truck. Well... That's, uh, not what I meant. I, I uh, have to pitch in a couple of days, and... Oh, come on, you're not really a ball player. Cute little thing like you. I'm a pitcher. A good pitcher. Well, how about pitching to me? What do you mean? <laughs> hey, Willie, can I have that bat you keep behind the bar? Are you kidding? What do you say? If you can't strike me out, we go out to the truck. Go ahead. Go. about this for a minute here. Are you sure you want to strike this guy out? What do you mean? I mean, what did you come in here for? Love one into him. <laughs> come on. Maybe this is a decision you should make with a few less beers in you. Maybe not.
pretty hard, don't she? <laughs> yeah, she struck out some farm boy, and now you call her Dizzy Dean? Come on. Okay, let's get all the girls. We gotta go. She's Donnie. What? May. Donnie. Great plan, May. Miss Cuthbert ran into her nephew Roy at the Rockford Station. Oh. What'd you tell her we were? Midnight Mass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. What? Hey, Jimmy, is this your old team? Yeah. Jack Phillips. Gabby Wallace. When you guys were in the series, our whole town in Oregon used to gather outside the telegraph office and listen to reports of the game. I can't believe this. Wow. Gee, thanks. Uh, how about a refill? I'm not a waitress. Tell him, Doris. This is Dottie Hintz, and Dottie's the best player in the whole league. Yeah. Yeah, ooh, ooh. That's like being an admiral of the Swiss Navy. Better best wrestler in nursery school. <laughs> Your heroes. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, go home and play with your dolls. <laughs> what are you saying? We can't play ball? Uh, hey, honey. Uh, Willie, give me a bit. None of us here except Jimmy's played for about ten years. Sure. But we can all play better than you did. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, first of all, I'm not your honey. Uh -uh. She's nice. Second of all... What? Nothing. <laughs> Come on, no, what? Yeah. Tell him. Yeah. I don't think you can play better than us. No. Nope. Yeah. Maybe yeah. once, but not now. Uh, <laughs> what do you think, Jimmy? I think, uh, boy, he's not so salty. <laughs> Jimmy, hey, hey. Lady asked you a question. <sighs> they beat you. Oh, oh, you know, Jimmy. 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 Day tomorrow. What do you say? How about a game? No, no, no. How about a movie? <laughs> You're on. Jimmy, you with us? Uh, no. No, I'm still in pretty good shape. If I played, I might hurt somebody. Oh, no, no, that's all right. That's all right. Hey, right, girls, tomorrow you're going to see baseball. Real men's baseball. The way it's meant to be played. Hey, Throw a few they can hit. Yeah. 
everything is stopping. You see? They're falling apart out there. They can't hold up. They're not tough enough. Let's go. Oh, yeah, come on. Hey, we're back in this ball game now, guys. Right. We can play better than this. Right. Let's reach back. Let's dig in. Let's go. Let's not holler. Come on. What kind of ball plan was that, huh? We had a bad inning. Yeah. And I'm Sheena, queen of the jungle. You did that on purpose. How dare you? How dare you play bad on purpose? I felt sorry for them. Sorry? They went to the World Series. What did you ever do? I once went to the World Fair. Jimmy, what do you want from us, huh? I mean, what are you saying? I got it. I got it. Oh. Oh. I I don't know what I'm saying. Look, most of these guys are going to die before the game is over anyway. It's just that I don't like to see you playing bad, especially on purpose. You people are ball players, professionals. Don't ever be ashamed of your talent. I just can't hit this girl. She's just too quick. Jimmy, get up there and hit me. Oh, no, no. No, I'm their manager. All right, all right, all right. We shot our mouths off good, and they were pretty good ball players. You'd feel awful good if we could win this one, Jimmy. No, I don't think so. Hey, kid, when was the last time you hit one out to win a game? Kid. Come on, kid. Pick us up one more time. Do get, do get, do get, do get, do get, do get,
go make the pudding. Wow. Thanks for explaining it to me. It's a lot different than Mom said. Yeah, well, you have to remember how Mom and Dad got married. He traded a bull for her. <laughs> I can only stay for a second. I uh, just came from the hospital. They released Gabby and Lou. The rest of the team gets out tomorrow. <laughs> Here, I want you to have this. Game ball. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. I just want to tell you girls. Um, see you tomorrow. Nice catch. Nice hit. Drop dead. You too. <laughs> Keep your family right there in front of the TV, because another favorite show is coming right up. The viewer acclaimed and requested, Brooklyn Bridge, is next.